What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 2 for my playthrough on the new Pokemon DLC, the Isle of Armor. So guys, in the last episode, we completed the three trials and unlocked Kubfu. Kubfu is now on our team. Now we're going to be moving along with the story mode and exploring the island a little bit more. So if you guys are hyped, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Check out our Pokemon party right here we're chilling with dragapult and telling we just have some stacked mods but we got our new squirtle in that last episode if you haven't checked out that first episode go show some love over there like it up hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed you guys already know the deal but we got g max blastoids well war turtle right now we gotta level up to a blastoids and we got our boy cub food chilling here he is the man yo look at him he is so sick but like i said in today's video we're just gonna be moving along with the uh different uh story mode and seeing what's going on so let's see what i have to do we go over here honey says hmm if only somebody no but i would gather so many blah 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 she's like up to something i think i'm not too sure but i'm gonna go talk to mustard and see what's going on and what i have to do what's this let's see how you and your cup are getting along getting there but still needs lots of room for improvement your bond will become stronger as you have battles and gain experience together i've put together little markers on the town map for you to view in the isle of armor okay so i have to go to certain places with cup let's check out the town map real quick let's check it out to see what's going on with it so these are these little town maps we had to go to we gotta go to the loop lagoon what is this brawler's cave challenge road and then hot bottom desert so i think since we're right here we're just gonna go over to here this is where we start off at so i guess i gotta go around or yeah maybe just travel all the way around to loop lagoon let's go do that let's go do that cup food come on though buddy we're gonna take my boy cup food all the way over there and start leveling him up but I believe we can choose from two Urshifus, fuse, which is our second stage, which is one's like the rapid one, and the other one is a uh, is a single strike one. So I'm planning on choosing the water one. Is that another Diglett? I was gonna say, is that another Diglett? But nah, we, we're still looking for 140 some Diglets now. We found three in the last episode. But we're just chilling here. We're gonna be catching some new Pokemon, such as you. I'm in love with Starmie. I think Starmie is one of the coolest water Pokemon ever. I love Starmie ever since Gen One. But Dragapult comes out here, we get battling, and I'm just going to throw a nice quick Ultra Ball right at it right away. But dude, this Isle of Armor is phenomenal. Seriously, hopefully you guys are all enjoying the Isle of Armor content. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys are loving it just as much as I am. So I'm going to use this Tackle. It doesn't affect Dragapult. I'm just going to throw another Ultra Ball at it and try to catch it. But like I said in the last episode, if you guys want to catch more content and more Isle of Armor content from me, link in the description below, Jeans25 on Twitch. We stream four plus days every single week. I'm going to be doing a playthrough of the Isle of Armor on here. And then over on my Twitch page, we're going to be capturing all the Pokemon and exploring everything that it has to offer. But Starmie's breaking out. I might just say screw it and catch this thing later. I think I need more uh, of a Pokemon that, uh, or get a Pokemon with False Swipe for over here. So just keep throwing Ultra Balls at these Pokemon. So we'll give it like one more Pokeball after this. I mean, it's not even budging. It's not even budging. So I think I'm just going to leave. Or maybe I'll battle. Oh, no. I don't even have to battle. I'm just going to run. I'm just going to run. Hey, yo. See you later. We got Dragapult. He's very, very fast. And we're just going to keep moving along with these missions. Yo, what? What is this? He follows me? What? That's tough. That is tough. I didn't even notice that. That did not happen in the last episode. That's so sick. Come on, Dragapult. We out of here. Oop, there's Toxpec. Oop, didn't mean to hit it. I already got Toxpec, so I'm just going to run from this thing. But yo, what you mean these things follow me? I can't really do anything. Like, I can't lead Cub Fu. He's only level 10. I got to keep leveling up. And the level scaling, all these Pokemon are going to be like level 60. So Dragapult's just chilling here. Um, Let me check out the town map. This is the way I have to go, right? Yes, I'm just going to loop around in the water. Let's go get it. Let's go get it. What's up, Glaring Slowpoke? We got Kingler chilling over here. Who's that? Got more slow pokes. Oh my god. This scene is just amazing. I'm in love with this game. I'm in love with this DLC. What is that? It's a Pokeball. Give me that. Got a max revive. I'll take that. No problem. Anything over here? Any newbies that I want to really catch? I don't really see much. Just Benaries. Let's go. We ouchie. Got these little new islands. We have fishing spots. What is that? That looks so cool. Still work out. See, I, yep. A storm will start a brewing. Arg. A storm is a brewing. Dragon Pulse still floating behind me. My dude. What? That is sick. Why can't I use my boost? Let me use my boost. That's whack. But is this the way to loop Lagoon? We got Tentacle right here. I got to catch him soon, too. What do we got here? That tree. That's about it. Oh, what is that? Do I see what? What is that? It's a Diglett. Yes, sir. I think that's so cool. How there's 150 Diglets just lurking around the island. I think that is so cool. What's over here? Do I go check it out? There you go. Here's our boost. Do I go check it out? Let's go check it out over here because we're just trying to explore the Isle. Isle of Armor. Beautiful. Is that, I think this is like a little cave area. 
Ooh, a little like a little area right here. Rotom fan spawns here. What? That's dope. Rotom fan just chilling here. And I keep thinking like Dragon Bolt spawning, bro. <laughs> He's just following up on me. But Loop Lagoon should be right around here. Let me check the map one more time. Let me check that town map. Is it right over here to the right? Oh, wait. I'm over here. How do I get over here? No, where am I? Is this me? How do I get over here? I thought I was here. I thought I traveled here. Wait just a minute. Oh, does the map loop back around? Wait just a minute. Loop Lagoon should be over here, right? I'm capping with me. Wait a minute, huh? This gotta be Loop Lagoon. Let me check the map again. Wait, what? Where am I at on the map? So we're over here now. I gotta get to here. How do I get from here? How do I go from here to here? I'm so confused. The Loop Lagoon's gotta be in between these things. I think I'm going the right way. I'm just gonna trust my gut here. Go in here. Gotta be Loop Lagoon, right? Yeah, this is Loop Lagoon. Gyarados is spawning here. Why is the map acting all wonky? Look, what is that? All right, so here we are in Loop Lagoon. Oh my god, we got Grapplox and Polisands, bro. I gotta get off my bike, yo. I'm gonna catch one of these Polisands. I am absolutely love this Pokemon. Or Polisand might be the second stage, but this thing is dope. This is Sandy Gas, which evolves into Polisand. I'm gonna catch this thing real quick. Dragon Pulse just chilling. We don't even have to throw him out in a Pokeball because he's just chilling there. We got Harsh Sunlight. I'm gonna catch this thing. And yeah, in today's video, we're just gonna be trying to... Uh, Oh, that's a critical catch. GG, baby. Give me that catch. But I'm going to be trying to uh, hit up all four of these, those spots that uh, Mustard told us to go to to train up Kupfu. But there we go. Sandy Gas. Get that. And we get the XP Kupfu leveling up. Kupfu wants to learn Aerial Ace. Yo, dude, forget a move. I'm going to train up this Kupfu, and this thing's going to be a beast. Let's get rid of Lore. Or Leer, not Lore. <laughs> and we get Aerial Ace, which is beautiful. War Turtle goes level 30. Wants to learn Aqua Tail. I don't really want to do anything with the War Turtle right now. I can always give it its new moves later. But we chilling. There we go. Kick Sandy Gas up here. He's part ghost, which is amazing. That thing keeps scaring me. But Talon Flame, what's up, Talon Flame? And yeah, what was that glitch? Who is that? That's that's Cobble. That's first stage of grab block. Um, so now I'm at this lagoon. Yo! First stage of Volcarona? Hold up! Hold up! Larvesta? Yeah, Larvesta right here. First stage of Volcarona up in here? I didn't even know that. I didn't even know that. I gotta catch it. Like I gotta catch it. Well, at least give it a try, you know? I should have picked up a bunch of uh, quick balls because they're the best to actually just catch right off the rip. Yo, one shake. Come on, give me two. Show me three, baby. Click it, click it. Huh? Bro, what you mean? He's gonna use takedown. <laughs> Misses. Come on, this ultra ball's it. This ultra ball's it. Let's get it. This one breaks out, I'm leaving. Come on, another shake. <laughs> Bruh, not dealing with you. Not dealing with you, but yo, we can get Volcarona. Volcaron. I didn't even know this Pokemon was in this deal. We'll see. Oh, there's a critical catch. Good thing I threw one one last Ultra Ball there, and we get the catch. Bang. That's what's the best about the Catch's Charm. It gives you that higher chance of getting those critical catches, and you can get them like that. But there we go. Kapu getting another level, or a few levels. Scary face. Ah, now you're good. All right. So now I gotta figure out what I have to do while chilling here. So we get to these spots, and we have to train up Kapu. I am here. Pokeball here. Or do I just have to explore them? Let's see. Let's go to my town map. But I am chilling here. Become friendly with Cub Fu and show it to Master Mustard. So do I have to like put the put Cub Fu in front? Is that what I have to do? What I have to do? Did I do it? Did I do do what I had to do? Oh no, I guess maybe the exclamation point will be gone. Where's Kupfu? Is Kupfu behind me? There he is. Hey, Kupfu. <laughs> Let's check that map. Does the exclamation point go away? No, it didn't. I guess I got to go forward a little bit. I got to get up there. Is there a way up there? That's my question. Do I battle with him here? Hmm. I think I'm going to have to figure this one out on my own. Right, I'm like right in the spot. Let me hop down here and see what's over there. Just Octillery. Come on, Kupfu. This way, buddy. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Or is there a trainer I have to talk to? Yo, Fletch, get out of here. Is there like a trainer I have to talk to? Bro, look at everything popping up. Yo, big rap locks. Uh, let's go over here. Let's go check out what's over here on this side. Artillery, what's goody? 
Wait, did I just have the battle? I'm very confused. I'm very confused. Let's give the map one more check out. I think we got a battle with one of them. Hmm. Let's go over on, what's this say? Roller's Cave. So, psh. We have to go back here, become friendly with Cup Fu and show it. Right, we got to figure this one out. <laughs> so I went back and talked to Mustard real quick just to make sure we were doing the right thing. So I believe we have to go to each of those spots on the map and just check it out. I think it's a way of the game telling us, yo, go explore all these areas and check it out there before we can actually start training up our boy Cup Fu. But I figured I'd just hop into a battle here real quick and uh, with Cup Fu in here and see if the exclamation point goes away. If not, I think I'm just going to go to each place and discover it so we're at the loop lagoon right now and then the other three places are all in a line i'll just fly back to the dojo and roll out from there but yo this fletchling just sent a tailwind i'm gonna actually throw a an ultra ball at it see if we can catch it let's get it let's get it we should be able to catch this thing fairly easy but i, I have a feeling it's gonna pop up now let's see Ray, give me the clickies yes sir okay easy catch easy catch nice little fletchling there but oh, beautiful we're checking out the loop lagoon and oh, it's beautiful it's beautiful Help we get some experience. Let's see if that exclamation point goes away. If not, we're, we gotta fly out anyway. So we checked out the loop lagoon. We got three other ones. And we can do proper training with Cubfu. I'm actually going to uh, switch out Pokemon. Just in case we do get in a battle. Let's swap out you. And then we're gonna go back to our town map. And this exclamation point still there. It is, it is. But that's the loop lagoon. That's totally fine. We're gonna fly back here. And then we have to make our way up this bridge. So, and then all the way through. Okay, that seems pretty easy. Let's fly here. And then get rolling. Get rolling. Dude, I love how we fly so quick, yo. Well, look at Inteleon, yo. Inteleon, let's go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that thing's hilarious. That thing is hilarious. But we're going back to the swamp area over here. Look at this place. Looking gorgeous. The soothing wetlands. Looking good. Um, Let's see which way I have to go. Is that a cave right there? I don't want to go check out that cave. I kind of want to go check out the cave, yeah. It's a cave, right? Yo, whoop, get out my face. Why is Whoops doing us dirty here? Whooper comes in here and uh, we got a battle. Inteleon's already out. Teleon looks weird when he's chilling out. At least, uh, what's it called? Look dope. Uh, Dragon Ball, he was just floating around, <laughs> like, flying. What's this cave lead to? I don't want to go in here and check it out. I think it leads to a different end. But I think we gotta go this way anyway, so... Let's give a quick peek. If I head through this cave, it should lead us here. Then we gotta find a way up here. The Brawler's Cave. Let's roll. Let's roll. But where's this Brawler's Cave? This is Brawler's Cave. Beautiful. Okay, so we are in Brawler's Cave. We got Wizmers. We got Woobats, Loudrings. Oh, Polyrath. Oh, my God. Yo, looking good. Looking real good. Let's head over this way. Yo, Gold Duck. Oh, my Lord. Yo, Brawler's Cave is where it's at. I think we head up here in order to get the next spot. <gasps> Yo, I'm catching this thing. I'm catching this thing. Well, what's his name thing again? I forget. Drudgegon. I was thinking Hydreigon, but I was like, wait. Hydreigon's the one with the three heads. We got Drudgegon right here. Oh, he's dope. I think we're going to see him in uh, some cool competitive battles. If we can get him first try, maybe crit catch. No crit catch. Any shakes? There's one. Show me two. This one's going to be a pain to catch. I don't think we're going to catch him. He's going to iron head me. Um, I'm going to throw another little ultra ball at this thing. And then if not, I guess we'll just run. I'll catch him later. But yo, dude. Stretch a guy chilling here. One shake. Come on, two me. Come on, show me three. Click it. Come on. Yes, sir. Let's go. Drudge gun. Not that hard to catch. But, dude, he's dope. He is so dope. War Turtle's going to level up 32. Kupfu's... Oh, who wants Iron Headbutt? Is it Kupfu? I think it's Kupfu. Yes, sir. Let's get rid of uh, Endor. And then we can do that. And there we go. War Turtle's got a couple more levels to actually be uh, fully evolved. Then we get a G-Max Blastoid. Like, bro, that's going to be dope. That is going to be awesome. Let's get Drudgegon up in here. I wonder if they added any new... Uh, minute? I think I want to see you over here, Diglett. <laughs> Any new G-Maxes that were not announced, like secret ones, I guess, like that they, that they just didn't tell us about. But Ballers Cave has been explored. We're going to head over to the next one. Here's a Raid Den. Oh, Gigalith chilling in here. And a TM Ball. And another Diglett. I don't think I didn't see you. Yo, I got the eye for Diglett. We got Iron Tail. I kind of want to see who is going to be inside this Raid Den. I'm going to check it out. What do we got? 2,000 watts and... Oh, Magneton, which who can evolve in the Magnet Zone, which is dope. Another Diglett. Come here, boy. I feel like these things are kind of like, uh, what's it called? Um, they're kind of like the, what are they even called? The Kuroks in Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, but there's not 900 of them. There's another one. Yo, dude, these things lurking all around here. Go. Come here, Diglets. <laughs> I like how quick they are to just grab. I think it tells me how many are in here. Is it four more in the cave? Lick your tongue chilling here. I think this is the way I had to go. Let's check out the map. Make sure I'm going the right way. If I head up here, yeah, we're going to be... Here's the Brawler's Cave, and then we head to the Challenge Road. 
The broader cave has been explored. Here's another diglet just lurking here, dude. The diglets are all over in the cave. Yo, three more. And then this way. Any any cool new Pokemon? Ooh, Rock Rough chilling there. What is that? Oh, that's my food. Or my food second season. Looking dope. Looking dope. But this should be the road that we have to go up to, right? Skarmory's. We were here last episode. All right, is this the place we want to go to? Let me actually go up here and see what's inside this building. Take my bike all the way up here. Oh yeah, let's talk to this lady. It's good. This is a tower of darkness. You are not ready to climb this tower. Leave this place. Okay, okay, I'm out of here. No problem. And I have a feeling there's a Diglett behind. There's gotta be a Diglett behind. Ooh, well, I'll take it to the end though. I thought there'll be a Diglett. Yeah, that's the road shop. Oh, that's a TR. Bro, no, not a TM. Whack. I thought there would be a Diglett right there. There's another poke. I don't really care. Okay, but we are here. Uh, which is my... Where do I gotta go after this? So, let's check out the town map. There should be one more place, right? So, we're here. We gotta make our way... Okay, through this cave. This is a pop bottom desert. So, I gotta go back down and into that cave. Where we got the max mushrooms at in the last video. Okay, easy enough. Simple enough. Let's get it. Head this way. Down here. Yoink. Hit that hard right. We go down this way, right? Yep, here's the steps. And now we're rolling Skarmory's. Oh, my lord. I feel like, like this island is so big. It's huge. I'm in love with it. Oh, big Tauros right there. Big dog. Scyther. Oh my god, Italian scared me. I cannot wait to play with Scissor and rank battles. It's gonna be dope. We got Milk Tank, Pincers, Pokeballs. Oh, that thing. I forget what that thing is. I know it starts with an S though. Teddy Ursa. I see a Teddy Ursa just showing there, right? No, that's the first stage. That's a little pup or something. But head through this cave. What's good, Cubone? What's good, Sandshrew? How you guys doing today? We can all spiffy. Uh, uh, TR or TM over here. I'm gonna pick it up real quick. We got TR Stealth Rock. I thought only TMs come out of that, but TRs I guess are coming. Yes, because we're on an island. That's a whole different thing. Torkoal. Ooh, give him a quick piece up. Um, I'm just gonna kill Torkoal. Can I kill him? Nah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna run. Not really worth it. Or I can level up Kupfu a little bit. I can level up Kupfu a little bit. We gotta take him through the view. That's what uh, Muster said. Muster said we have to go through the view and all that. Or take him to each of these places. Take Kupfu to each of these places so we can create a better bond. Something like that. But again, I think it's just a game telling us, you know, you gotta explore these areas. But Kupfu gets a level. War Turtle almost gets a level 32 and 23. Not bad. Not bad. More Torkoals. We got this little shiny thing. We got Quick Ball. Ooh, that's gonna be coming handy. Where are we at now? This is the Pot Bottom Desert. Okay, so this is... Do we explored everything. Now, um, this desert's sick. Oh my god, Braviary's in here. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is this? What is this? You wouldn't think I'd see you, Diglett? <laughs> Diglett, get out of here. There's nine more Diglets in here. It's pretty cool how they tell you how many Diglets there are. I mean, this Pokeball. Flame Orb. Okay, I'll take that. Is there anything in the pot bottom desert that I can explore? Oh my god, we got this thing. I'm gonna catch this thing. What is it? What is that, though? Rhyperior. Oh my god, and we got these little crocodiles. I love the final evolution of it. We got Sandile. The big ones, he's like red, right? Looks so sick. Like fully red, and he just looks amazing. Right, let's throw a nice little Pokeball at it. Get it. All right, I think we can head back to the Master, the Master Mustard now. He's gonna send Sandstorm, you know, but it failed. There's already a Sandstorm rolling. I'm surprised we didn't, we didn't even get a shake out of that. Like, what, what was that? Just catch the sand dials here. Give me some shakes. There you go. Now we're talking. Show me three. There you go. Click it down. And a boy. Let's get it. <laughs> sand dial was caught. Beautiful. All right. So that should be all the little sections we had to explore, right? I think we just go to it. Like, it, 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 it's they're very vague. They were very vague with it. It's like, oh, go show Kung Fu Wong. I'm going to lurk around here just a little bit longer. See what's going on here. That's Sand Slash. See any new Pokemons that are cool? Oh, we got the... The, the little snake. I forget what that thing's called. <laughs> but he's dope. Um, we should be able to fly back now. I think I think we just did, did it dirty. Did it dirty. We did the works. Um, Let's check out the map real quick. Well, we're going to have to check out the map when we're flying. But is this like the only thing back here? Yeah, it's just the desert. But I should be able to fly back here. We should be friendly enough with a little bit of Kung Fu action. I'm going to head inside here. Italian, sorry, buddy. He's just walking around with us. He's, he's hilarious. I should be able to go over here. Talk to my boy Mustard and see what's going on. Mustard, did we do what you wanted? Let's see. What is this? Let's see how you and your cup crew are getting along. Ooh, I can tell you're warming up to each other. I hear the Sooth Bell is great for becoming friends too. I put a little markers on your town map where you view. Okay. So I think I just got to keep going around and join the scenery. Once you two are best friends, we'll start with Kupfu's 
proper training. Okay, so last time he said something else. Last time he said something totally different to uh, what I just heard. He said we were actually becoming friends. So did he add new markers or... No, th these are the same markers. So let's just keep exploring. I'm going to actually go explore the that place again. The Loop Lagoon. I'm going to explore the loop, the loop Lagoon once again. And keep trading up with him and catching some more mons. No, I'm chilling with this. I'm having a blast. I'm having a blast. Na -na -na -na. Na -na 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 -na. Yeah, let's just keep traveling with him. I think that I think that's is what we are going to just be doing in today's video is just uh getting proper friendship with Cub Fu and uh, finishing up this little part of the story and then in the next episode we'll be continuing on and catching more Pokemon. But it is actually cool to actually check out all these different areas. So this this episode is more of just like an exploring the island kind of episode, which is fun, which is fun, seeing all new Pokemon. But yeah, I feel like I gotta uh, look around Loop Lagoon a little bit more, just just see everything that it has to all. This isn't Loop Lagoon. We gotta go around one more. Get pedaling, baby. Get pedaling. We'll head around this right side. Chilling. What's all the way over there? We got a little islands. Yeah, Loop Lagoon, we only went on the island and then just like kind of sat there a little bit. So I'm gonna uh, go around to like that cave and all that. See what else there is. Got Gyarados chilling here. I like how Gyarados just pops up. He's like guarding it. We got that big, big, big raid den right there. That purple raid. You guys know the purple raids are the good ones. What's this cave lead to? Get up on here. Let's get up on here. And yo, look at this. We got Diglett again. Come here, Diglett. I'm like right on top of him. Come here! Diglett! Yeah, I was gonna say, I know I see you. <laughs> so how many is there in... Okay, there's six in Loop Lagoon. Pretty cool. We got the Sandy Gas chilling. What's over here? Dreadnoughts. What is that? That's a little uh, first stage of a uh, Grapple Lock. Grapple Lock. This is back to Brawler. Is this Brawler's Cave? This is... Okay, this is a different cave. Oh, look at this! We got a bunch of choodles. We got the Lissapod. Over on this side. This leads to a whole different area. This is just another cave, which is looking dope. Oh my god, we almost stepped on the wind pod. But another diglet. Don't mind if I do. Catching all these boys. Alright, let's keep rolling. Oh my god! <laughs> that thing scared me. That thing scared me. We got a crustal right here. I already have one of these from uh, my original Pokemon Sword and Shield playthrough. Which I wonder what you get if you complete the Pokedex right here. You know what I'm saying? If you complete the Pokedex here, do you get like a shiny charm for here? I don't know how that works. Anything over here? I think we're gonna head back. This is Challenge Beach. We're gonna head back and go explore the other side of Loop Lagoon. It's weird. I don't know how I would know. Oh, Pinchurchin. <laughs> Pinchurchin spawns. Tentacool. Tentacruel, my fault. But I wonder if they'll tell us when uh, we're done with all the. Uh, with leveling up and just befriending Kofu. Then over to the side, we got Wingles chilling. It's over here. What is that in the ground? That's just uh, obviously stuff. I don't really feel like picking up that TR. Anything over here? And just travel around Loop Lagoon. But it's cool. I'm starting to actually uh learn more about the island and all that. I doubt we can get up there. But anything over here? Can I do like a big loop? Beautiful, yo. It's beautiful. Stepping stone C. This can actually lead us around to where I want to go. So there's that big tower. It's like the big tower that I think where you get Urshifu, or when you uh, start befriending Kafu a lot more. Oh my lord. I actually want to go check out that raid den real quick. Do I do a raid den? <laughs> do I dare do a raid den here? Artillery, Tentacool. Here's the challenge beach. Star you, Tingler. What's goody, people? Just befriending out here. Oh, real? Who is that? Psyduck, dude! What's good? And we weren't here yet. It's a totally different area. There's Cramorant spawning. Pretty dope. What is that in the water? Corefish, bro. <laughs> that Corefish. Now we're back at the Soothing Wetlands. So this is to the right side of the Soothing Wetlands. I can actually head down this way again. We got that thing. I totally forget that thing's name. That's dope. That's dope. Right, let's head over this way. And we were here last time. We were in this little area last time. We were trying to find that other area. What is it? Where, where we got the max mushrooms at? Yo! Oh my god, I totally forget what that thing's called, but that's what what's called is gonna have Clara. Oh my lord! This game crazy. This game's crazy. See you later, Amoongus. Now let me travel back to uh, all those areas and see how uh, our friendship levels up then. Do I have to battle more with him? Maybe I have to battle more with him. Oh, what's over this bridge? Did I go here last time? It's the training lowlands. And this is here, Scyther. I'm gonna go explore this area a little bit more. 
I feel like we explored the cave a good I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna try to explore every single area. Let's just challenge road again. Or maybe I didn't explore that last area. Because I don't remember getting the name pop up for it. Do I have to go down somewhere? Down this way? Wait, let me check the map. Let me check the map. Let me check the map. Actually, I think we did explore it. It's called the... What is this thing called? The challenge road. Yeah, so we're here. We explored the challenge road pretty well. Um, and then we just need to go back around to the desert. Do I even go back to the desert? Well, I feel like I catch Lake and Rock here. Let's get it. Yo, what's good, Lake and Rock? What's good? Yo, he's so sick. I like how he changes in the nighttime. Doesn't he do that? So how does that work in a max battle? Or not max battles, rank battles. I'm not too sure how it works. Oh, I got a quick ball. I'm just going to throw it real quick. Get, get it. Quick ball. Throw it real quick. Here we go. Puck that thing over there. Yay! Slap that down. Give me this Lake and Rock. There you go. One shake. Two shake. Show me three. Click it. Click it. Bro, dude, quick balls, rock guy. If you guys are trying to complete the Pokedex, buy a bunch of quick balls. I know I do not have quick balls myself, but buy a bunch of them. Whenever you get into your first battle, just throw a quick, quick ball over there, and then it's pretty much GG. Most of the time, you'll catch them. But Club Food wants to learn Brick Break, which is actually a solid move, and it could be good in a uh, competitive, too, with the Brick Break. So I'm going to teach it. It can break screens, all that good stuff. War Turtle levels up to 34. Let me chill in here. Dun, 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 dun. Do not have do I have a sooth bell? I actually want to check that back because uh Muster was saying like how if you give him a sooth bell, it'd be a little bit better. And they should be in uh it would be in uh what, what items would they be in? Other items. Sooth bell. And I doubt I have a sooth bell, which I think I should, considering I have so many different items. Sooth bell, show me sooth bell. Just no, no, we do not have sooth bell. We do not have the sooth bell. That's fine by me. Let's keep heading down here. I'm just gonna uh, capture a few more Pokemon and start heading back to the, uh, to the what's it called? Actually, I'm gonna should I catch them in the cave because that is where we need to go, and then I'm gonna head back to Mustardo, the Mustardo. Come on this way, baby, and see how our uh, friendship is leveling up. So, any new Pokemon here? I saw the the Mindfus first stage. What is that? What is that that thing scary? I don't even know what it is. Ah, oh, Salazzle <laughs> or Sal Salandit. I already have you, dude. Get out of here. It's weird. We don't have to throw out Pokemon on this island. It's just like, they just stand next to us and then they join us in the battle. <laughs> right, let's keep rolling and just see what's going on. Right, this thing. I kind of would rather catch the first stage. There's Skarmory. No need for Skarmory. I'm going to head back to the cave. Head back to the cave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think my goal is to get this thing to level 30. Can I give? Um, Can I give? Whatchamacallit? The XP charm? Why can't I? I just don't get why can't I use it now. So it doesn't matter. I think level 30, we're gonna get it up to. Just keep befriending this thing. Got Loudring, Wismer, all these bats. <laughs> and another Diglett I missed. Come here, boy. Get over here. Diglett, get back. We got two more in this cave, too. We, we kind of beat up this cave real quick. Let's catch Lickitung. Let's catch Lickitung. I do need and I do need Lickitung, and there is another Diglett to our right. I saw that. Lickitung, what's good? What's goody, big dog? And you know, why does Inteleon do that little shake? I don't get it. Where's my? Where are my Ultra Balls? Imagine I throw my Master Ball next to but No! <laughs> Let's go, baby. Give me Lickitung. So that means Licky Licky's in the game. Mm-hmm. I love all the Gen 4 like new evolutions like uh, Tangela, Second Sage, Tangela. Uh, Magnezone, Magmortar, Electivire. I love all of them. Like, Tokus is even in that group. They're all just so cool. But there we go. Get that going. And do I just take out... I think I'm just gonna uh, bop on that Giglet just for the XP. You know what I'm saying? Just for the XP. Actually, hold up. I have XP candies if I really want to level up. <laughs> I'm gonna give him the Kupfu. I have a few. I think I only have, like, yeah, see, I have one XL. I'm gonna use this item on him. There you go, Kupfu. Take it all. Yes, sir, Kupfu. Once learn detect, uh, no, we'll keep all moves. Bulk up, yes, you can learn bulk up. That is a tough move. We'll get rid of Rock Smash, I don't think we need it. Bulk up for Cub Fu. And what else for you? Any other moves? Nope, and I'm gonna give him one more. Come here, there you go, buddy. 36, that's tough. All right, level 36, Iron Head, yes. You can learn Iron Head, that's a good move. Get rid of Headbutt for that. Ta-da! You can learn Iron Head, any other moves, big dog? No, you're chilling. So level 36, not bad. Let's go back to Mustardo. Can I fly out of here? I believe I can. Let's go back to Mustard and see our progress. See if we are done yet. And what's that little island? You see that island with a crown on it? I wonder what that is. But we are in the fields of honor. 
And then go back over here. Check out my boy. Yo, mustard. What's goody? We done? What is this? Let's see how you and Cup Cooper get. You're just starting to become friends. How wonderful. Don't forget playing together while camping is a great way to build. Okay, so we are almost done. So once you two are best friends, we'll start. Okay, so I gotta try I gotta go into my campsite with him. Maybe make him some food, play with him. I never really did this before, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it right now. Let's go to my camp. So Pokemon camp, let's set it out and let's just uh, mess around with Kubfu. So, where's he at? Kubfu! How do I get him? Take out Toy. Come here, Kubfu. Kubfu, right here, yes. Come here, buddy. Yeah! Uh, okay. Oh, he's gonna punch. He's gonna punch. Come on, punch me. Yo, what's your problem? Let me change toys. Uh, can I throw it? Yeah. Get it. <laughs> no. Extra, get out of here. Get the ball. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Take it, change toys. <laughs> no, go get this ball. How do I throw it far? I don't even know how to throw it far. Okay, that was a decent throw. No, T-Tar! What are you doing? Kapu, get it! T-Tar, give me the ball back. Come on, Kapu. Zoom in. So we can cook with them. Let's cook with Kung Fu. We're cooking. Can I cook with Kung Fu, right? I don't even know how to do this cooking, but I'm going to cook it. Please select the berry. We'll go orange berry. Well, how many berries do I pick? And then, no, no, wait. No, I want to go back. Oh, no, okay. We just have to pick berries now. Leaky berry. Am I cooking with Kung Fu? Here, take these chill onions. Am I cooking with cubs? Where's cub food at? I don't know how to cook. I really do not. <laughs> this is my first time cooking, so we're gonna see how we do. Start. I know I gotta fan it. Yeah! Fan it! Yeah! Get it, baby! <laughs> fan those flames, baby. I'm just mashing, eh? I don't know if that's how you do it. But can I feed the food to cub food or something like that? This is pretty dope. We are fanning it. Oh, they're all happy. Look at that. Look at that flame, yo. How do I stir? My right stick, right? Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. We stirring, baby. Get that stir going. Yes, sir. <laughs> this is my first time cooking, guys. You guys are probably like, Gene, you never cooked your curry yet? Nope, not once. But, yo, how do I do it? Do I just keep doing that? Yeah, I just keep stirring. There we go. Stir it up good. Press A at the right time. Did I do it right? I think I messed up. I think I messed up on that one. Let's see how we did. We put a little bit of loving in it. And boom. All done. All done. Where's, yeah, there's Cub Fu. I just had to make sure he's here. Yo, eat up, boys. Dry herb. Meddling curry. <laughs> we ripped it up. No! Not Inteleon. I didn't want to do that with Inteleon. Why Inteleon? Yeah, I know you guys like it. Copper said class. That stinks. Hey, Cub Fu, get over here. Cub Fu. Come here, little buddy. Come here, little buddy. I'm gonna hit you up one more time. I'm gonna make you punch or something. There you go. Now I'm gonna exit out of this camp. I'm out of here. I like to quit the camp. Does he get XP for it? I believe so. Yeah, there we go. He got 800 for it. That's wonderful. That is wonderful. Okay, so we chilled in the camp a little longer. Um, we gotta talk to uh, my boy one more time. And if he's not fully done, I'm probably just gonna uh, finish this up. And then I'll cut back when I am done. Let's go see. Let's go see. Are we done it yet? We do it. We're just starting to become friends. Okay, so we got to wait a little bit longer in order to become best friends. So we will be back here when me and Kung Fu are best buddies. Let's get it, guys. Me and Kung Fu, I believe we are now best friends. I cooked some curry with him off screen, and I went to each of those little exclamation point places, and I walked around with him. So what I mean by walked around with him is I put him in the front of my party, so we walked out, and he was chilling. And now we got this little cutscene chilling. Good, good. You two are just the best of friends now, aren't we? Oh, yes, sir. Cup Fu is more confident now, and now I can actually follow him, and we can get moving along with this next part. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. He just said follow me, so we're going we're gonna to follow him. Me and Cup Fu just chilling here. Let's get it. What's he going to make us do? Where are we at? Oh, we're out here. Dum dum dee dee la la dee da. What? <laughs> Where's he taking us to? Yo, look at this dude. Look at this dude. Mustard's the man. Woo, I guess it's a good spot as any. What do you want us to do? Now then, jeans and Cup Fu. If you want to become stronger, there's a special training ground just for Cub Fu. 
prepare themselves for the Tower of Two Fists. Oh, it's that big tower. Oh, yes, sir. The blue tower is Tower of Water, and this one's Tower of Darkness. Choose wisely since you'll only be able to climb one of the two towers. So this is when we can uh, evolve them, I think, in the Urshifu, and choose if I want them to be the Rapid Strike or the Single Strike. One's Water and Fighting, the other one's Fighting and Dark. So I can decide that myself later and in the next episode. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As the next episode, we're going to be choosing our tower and moving along, exploring the island even more. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.